Right then guys, I just thought I'd do a very quick charity shop haul. So I just got a few bits today from a uh, local town. Um, I've got a couple, well, I've got one dud in there really. Uh, that one, I'm not so sure about. I probably need to do a bit more research into that one. But that one there is a uh, Sony, one sec, let me focus it in a bit better. Uh, $2.99, a Sony 5x CDR audio, um, sort of like blank CDs. I thought this would be better than it is. I didn't actually check sold. Obviously, you can see it's brand new and sealed there. Um, but one has sold for £3.50 plus postage, so not very good. However, there isn't any on at the moment, so I might shoot a little bit higher than that. Try and squeeze maybe a tenner out of it. And, uh, yeah, obviously, at some point, hopefully, that'll sell. Get my money out of, out of it and reinvest into something better. Um, so this is like a ceramic, um, I don't know whether it's hand-painted, is it hand-painted? Yeah, it's hand-painted, uh, Delft's blue, um, sort of, you know, ceramic shoe type thing, or clog. Um, £1.50 I paid for it in the charity shop, made in Holland. Um, I did check solds, there's only international sales though. Uh, it seems like they're ranging anywhere from like £5 to about £20. Uh, I couldn't really, I don't know whether I checked listed, I don't think I did. Um, but I'm thinking maybe just whack it on for a tenner or something plus postage. Maybe a little bit more and just get it gone. Bit of a pump really, didn't know whether it would be good to go on or not. But yeah, 150 for that thought, why not at 150 I'll take a punt. Next was obviously something I really uh, love, which is Fat Lava. Quite an unusual design this one, quite quite cool uh, obviously nothing spectacular um, there's way way better pieces out there than this one but I, I quite liked it it was quite cool uh, paid two quid for that there and uh, you can see on the bottom there we've got the design number or pattern number I can never I, I, I never remember which one it is whether it's a design or pattern number and then we've got the obviously the 26 which is the height of the piece so it's 26 centimeters tall this piece so yeah, pretty cool. Probably looking at maybe 15, 20 quid on that. Might shoot for 20, uh, see if I can get it, but I may have to come down to 15. But yeah, that was that one for two quid, so quite happy with that. Next, something I took a bit of a punt on, these sort of little hand-painted Art Deco, um, uh, what are they called, little bowls. Um, you can see six dishes for £2, however, I've not got six here. Um, one of them actually had a chip in them, and I actually got the five here for £1.50. A little bit of a shame that it's not a full set, obviously, but I thought I'd still take a chance on them for 150 for the five, because I think that someone will still have uh, the five there. Uh, I'll still be, you know, looking for the five or buy the five. I'll just uh, focus that in a bit better. See if that'll focus in. One sec. Oh, I don't know if it's going to focus in very well. Anyway, it says Hampton Ivory uh, Swinnertons, made in England. And I mean, it's like lilac time or something. Um, so yeah, quite a nice little uh, set. Now, I've seen a few uh, few like bowls and stuff from this company go for about 10 quid. And then one was like 18 quid, 19 quid. But that was a little bit of a bigger bowl. I'm thinking for the five there, I might try for 20 quid and see where I'll go from there. If I have to come down, I have to come down. But I think 20 quid for the five, that's fair enough. I mean, that's like four quid each, so... Uh, yeah, I'm going to go for that on those ones. But then the piece of the day that I really liked, um, and that you don't you don't really find these in charity shops that often. Uh, this is, well, first off, I paid £3 for it. You can see it's in that kind of Art Deco style. Uh, again, well, it is Art Deco, actually. Uh, not just an Art Deco style, but um, it is actually there. I don't know whether it's going to focus very well. Chameleon Wear, Clues & Co. Uh, Tunstall, made in England. Uh, good maker, decent maker that, um, and yeah, probably going to go for anywhere between about 20 and 30 quid. I'll double check solds because I've not actually checked solds on this, um, but I'm thinking maybe shoot high end of that. Um, but as I say, I will check solds just to, just to double check that, but from 3 quid, I was more than happy with that. Nice little piece there, good maker, and I should get some good return on that. However, may take a little while to sell because the last time I had one of these... I actually had a really, really nice green piece, and it did take a while to sell, but we'll see. Anyway, so that's a little haul from today, guys. I uh, hope you enjoyed it. It's only a very quick one, and I will see you in the next one. See you very soon, guys.